Fear is the strongest of all emotions. It's what's kept us alive for millions of years, saved us from predators. And now I'm going to do an experiment to show you the power of fear. Is that scary? Does that feel scary? Yeah. You can never underestimate fear. The power of fear on our mental health, our well-being, but also specifically our own body and what it can do to our body. Can fear actually create a haunting? It's not a huge leap to say that fear could actually make you think that an object is moving of its own accord. So I brought you here for this fear experiment and what's going to happen is a number of different stages. So first of all we need to get your consent that you're happy to be put into a fearful environment. And then we've got some pre-tests that we want you to do. Once you've done that, hook you up to physiological measuring equipment. One thing is troubling me, Kieran. Um, on the wall, there's a little blue plastic box that has written on it, urine and vomit spill kit. <laughs> um, some people do have adverse reactions to the VR. We're then gonna put you into the virtual reality environment you're going to be walking through a haunted house. Oh, oh God, it's totally dark. Whoa, what was that? Oh! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! Ah! What was that? Oh my God, there is a lantern floating in the air. Whoa, where is he now? Whoa! What the hell is that? Oh God. God, I'm feeling shivers down my spine now. Ah! After 10 more minutes of me basically screaming, Lynn rescues me. Kieran leads me through another door in the lab. What I'd like you to do is you're going to stay in this room for about 10, 15 minutes. Just reflect on the experience you've had anyway in the VR. Just look out for anything. Kieran closes the door, leaving me alone in the room. You have that anticipation that I might be doing something. You've got fear everything starts to be elevated. You're starting to get nervous and anxious about the environment. So imagine, for example, a cup falling off a table or an object falling, something like that. But in that state of mind, with fear playing havoc with you, that then turns into, I think that cup just flew off the table. 